promised in the last lesson that we'd put the G and the C to some good use, and here it is. Uh, you remember that earlier on we had our E, A, and D, and we, we just changed around in a, in a circle. We went E, A, D, E, A, D, E, A, D, just going around and around to practice your strumming. Mm. You can do the same thing with your G, C, and D. So you've got one and two and three. simply. So this is going to be a relatively short lesson. I just want you to practice the same sort of thing that you did with the E, A and D. Now you're doing G, C and D. We're playing just in a different key and we're going to talk about key signatures uh, later on. But for now, all you need to know is that uh, that's the chord progression that we're going to do in a circle. G, C, D, G, C, D. Just round and round counting one and two and three and four and and enjoy yourself with that. In the next lesson, we're going to learn the all-important B seventh chord. And then you're going to see that with uh, all the chords that we've learned up to this point, you've really got quite an arsenal of uh, chords that you can use.